Hello, hello. <laughs> hey, this is a big deal, <laughs> you know. I couldn't believe it happened, to be truthful with you. I, I, I can't go sleep. 110 years it took to have this opportunity to sit here in downtown Indianapolis. This year, LAO, you finally joined the club. I remember going to the museum and filming the trophy. One day my face is going to be here. When did it sink in that you actually had become a winner at the Indianapolis Mercy Speedway? About a week later, it just dawned on me all of a sudden. I looked in the mirror and said, you won Indy. I'll tell you what, the last couple of laps, the longest laps I ever made. Grown men don't shed tears, the heck they don't. <laughs> It's something about you guys, the good old boys, it's special. To be part of this group here means so much to me. It's an honor. I just feel out of place with these three guys because I'm an outlaw because they all drove for Roger Pinsky. <laughs> I wasn't good enough. <laughs> it wasn't a goal to get to Indy. We were just having fun on the weekends. You didn't have all them safety walls even. You hit the wall back then. It was solid concrete. When you win the Indianapolis 500, the vault doors open and everybody wants a chunk of you. Before that, they say, who are you? What's your name? I look and I saw my family uh, holding hands. I was like, holy moly, I, I guess we're going to make this happen. So this is going to be pretty special. AJ has won his fourth Indianapolis 500. Allenson joins AJ Foyt. Rick Mears becomes the third four-time winner. Elliot Kessler Nevins! Welcome to the four-time club! I will never forget this day.